particularly in conservation tillage or no-till systems, which are becoming more prevalent in cereal growing areas around the world because of their environmental and economic benefits. The mycelium of Rhizoctonia solani can freely colonize the undisturbed soil, drawing nourishment from plant debris. But the fungus is also well prepared for adverse conditions. It forms compact structures consisting of tightly packed hyphae. These sclerotia can survive in soil for years until they finally germinate. The hyphae are attracted by chemical stimulants released from the roots of young host plants. Colonization of the root surface begins with long, sparsely branched hyphae called runner hyphae. These aggregate, forming a dense cushion. From this infection cushion, hyphae grow downward. With the aid of enzymes, the fungus destroys the intercellular cement. Gradually, the root tissue dissolves. The resulting macerated cells provide a rich habitat for the fungus.